While everyone in the United States is protected under the Fair Housing Act, the application process can be significantly more difficult for visa holders. To avoid a potential discrimination lawsuit, you should prepare your leasing process to include practices that can vet your applicants equally. Consider accepting these alternative forms of documentation to ensure applying to your property is easy for everyone. Passports. You want to confirm that the applicant really is who they say they are, but in most cases, they probably don't have a state-issued ID or driver's license yet. The most reliable form of identification in this case would be their passport. Proof of employment. As with any applicant, you'll need to see that they have a steady source of income. Visa applicants can prove they're financially reliable through copies of bank statements, tax returns, and student grants. Social Security Numbers While some applicants with visas might have a Social Security number, it's important to note that not everyone does. Regardless, you should always accept Social Security numbers from applicants, as it can be used to run their credit report. You will not be able to run a credit report with a taxpayer identification number. The previous landlord's contact information. Another way you can see if the applicant is reliable is to contact their previous landlords. While this should not be your only means of figuring out whether or not an applicant is reliable, in combination of additional documents, contacting the previous landlord can help secure your final decision. For more information about how to make your rental process more inclusive to visa holders, click the link below to read the full article.